Shanahan just told regional security chiefs that the U.S. will continue to uphold a free and open Indo-Pacific. He said perhaps the longest, uh, the greatest long-term threat to the vital interest of states across this region comes from actors who seek to undermine the rule-based international order. That's his direct swipe at China. Uh, prior to the meeting, Shanahan has said that Beijing's military actions in the disrupted uh, South China Sea are, quote, excessive. Today, he said behaviors that erode other nations' sovereignty and sows distrust of China's intentions must end. His remarks, of course, comes as uh, uh, tensions between U.S. and China escalate over the trade war and on other security issues, including Taiwan. And we can be certain that Beijing will not take those criticism lying down. Beijing certainly wants his voice heard loud and clear. General Wei Fenghe is the highest-ranking Chinese official to appear at this event in eight years. He's also brought several uh, senior defense officials with ex as experience in the South China Sea. Beijing has blamed the U.S. and its allies for escalating tensions by carrying out naval operations in the region. Uh, Wei will also uh, likely to uh, speak on the issue on Taiwan, which China claims as its uh, sacred territory. And will take by force if necessary. And Beijing has said Washington is playing with fire uh, in its uh, support for the island. And of course, uh, trade is front and center. Uh, there will be many questions asked about security implications to the trade war and how the Chinese military will respond. Uh, questions we hope uh, will be answered tomorrow in that very rare speech and Q&A.